Hey fam, my name is Hakeem Bradley and our verse of the day is from James 119. My dear brothers and sisters, take note of this. Everyone should be quick to listen, slow to speak, and slow to become angry. When you and I follow these instructions, we prevent ourselves from operating in the way of Cain towards our brother and sister. So if we think back to Genesis 4, there's a conflict between these brothers. You know, there's a whole uh, sacrifice ceremony to God, God looks favorably to Abel, and Cain becomes angry as a result, very angry, in fact. And God approaches him and he says, hey, you still have an opportunity to do well. Why is your face downcast? Um, but be careful because sin is crouching at the door and its desire is to have you, but you must rule over it. And then Cain's you know, immediate action after that is he takes his brother out into the field and he murders him. So I think the, the wisdom here is that you and I have an opportunity when we have conflict with our brothers and sisters to not be reactive, but to be quick to listen because we might actually learn something uh, from our brother or sister that we are in conflict with. And we might actually realize, oh, I'm actually in the wrong here because I'm willing to hear you out. To be slow to speak is to not be sharp with our words towards one another when we are in conflict because our words carry weight and our words can tear down or they can build up one another. But when we are quick to, to speak out of anger, it is, it is mostly, if not always, that we are tearing down if our anger is coming from an unjustified place. And so with that said, um, the encouragement that I wanna continue to throw forth here, when you are in conflict with somebody today or this week, think back to what James is instructing here. How can you navigate that moment with your brother or sister? to actually lead to a place of reconciliation rather than a place that further divides you two, like Cain and Abel. Grace and peace, man.